Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to update case record when the owner was updated from Omni Channel. Whenever Salesforce Omni Channel assigns the case to an owner, the triggers, assignment rules, and other automations will not be fired. Once the agent accepts the case, then they can edit the case so that it can execute the process automations. But if we have some business critical process that has to be taken care when the agent uh, accepted the case and the owner was changed from Omni channel, then we can make use of a record triggered flow on agent work entity. Whenever a case is routed via Omni channel, Salesforce creates two records. One is pending service routing and the other one is agent work. Using the agent work record, the records are assigned to an agent via Omni channel. So I created a record triggered flow and the object is agent work. And this will be fired when the record is updated. When the agent flow record is created, it is part of a routing. When the agent accepts it, the agent work record will be updated. So I am firing this record triggered flow only when the record is updated. Condition is status is equal to opened. When the agent accepts the case record via Omni channel, the status of the agent work will be opened. So I am making use of status as opened. In agent work entity, we have work item ID. That's where the record which is routed to the agent via Omni channel is stored. In my case, I am routing the case record. So I am using work item ID starts with 500 because the object key prefix for case object is 500. So whenever the case record is routed, and when the agents accepts it via Omni channel, then this record triggered flow will be fired. I am using assignment element and then I have OBJ case record variable. I am assigning the ID to work item ID, which is the case record that was routed via Omni channel and the description of the case, I am setting it as assigned via Omni channel assignment and the status of the case, I am setting it to working. Using update records element, I am updating the case which was assigned by a, sorry, assigned via the assignment element. So now Whenever a case is routed via Omni channel and if the agent accepts it, it will fire this record triggered flow. It will update the case. So let's see that. So I'm creating a sample case with the subject as testing, origin as email, type is mechanical, priority is low, status I'm setting it to new, owner ID is uh, QID. Here, it will update the case to working. The status of the case will be set to working. But when I create the case, I am setting the status to new. Let's see that. So I'm executing it. It created a case. Let me go online in Omni. I'm getting the case. I am accepting the case. Subject is testing, which we created. Description is updated. Status is also updated. So whenever we have a business critical process as part of case ownership change, and if the case ownership was changed via Omni channel, then we can make use of record triggered flow on the agent work entity to, uh, to do that business process operations. Please check the video description. 
In the video description, I have shared my blog post. From the blog post, you should be able to get the sample flow references with the screenshots using which you can build your record triggered flow. I hope it was helpful. Thank you for watching.